welcome to Ganzo. My name is Andrea Trapani, I'm the executive chef here. Today I'm gonna propose a recipe using a seasonal ingredients. What are we using? Zucchini flour. First of all, I wanna show you the two different flour. You might not think of it, but even flowers have a gender. The male comes out of the plant directly on a stem stuck to the plant, while the female grows directly on the fruit. It's a little smaller with the thicker petals. How do I clean a zucchini flower? So I need to clean it, I need to prepare it. After washing it and after drying it, I'm gonna remove the external leaves this way. Okay, after removing the external leaves, I'm gonna proceed removing the internal pistol, which I'm going to show you. See, this part right here. Just pull it out gently without breaking the flowers. At this point, close all your flowers and set them aside. I will serve deep fried zucchini flowers. So I'm now going to prepare a batter, which are the ingredients for my batter. I'm using a double zero flour, or 300 grams. I'm using 50 grams of cornstarch. This will help to give an extra crispy texture. And I'm gonna mix it with 500 milliliter of sparkling cold water. Add your water gradually, whisking it in, preventing lamps to form or breaking the lamps if any will. Energically whisk it to make sure all lamps come out. At this point, I'll set it aside. I'm now preparing a pairing sauce for our deep fried zucchini flowers. What am I using? Greek yogurt, lime, chopped dill, and salt from Sicily, sea salt from Sicily. Okay, I'm gonna mix my ingredients. First, I soften the yogurt. I'm gonna incorporate a touch of salt, my chopped dill, a little bit of lemon zest will give an extra freshness to my dip. A little bit of the lime juice. A little bit of uh, olive oil, which will extend aromas perception and also give a nice shiny color. Okay, I'm ready to complete the dish. Always give a nice stir to your batter just before frying. Make sure your petals are nicely closed. Dip your flowers into the batter. Remove the exceeding batter. Fry them in oil. I'm using sunflower oil at 170 degrees. During the cooking, you can flip your zucchini occasionally. Make sure they don't get stuck to each other. Okay, my flowers reached a nice golden color and a crispy texture. I'm ready to remove them. Salt it lightly. You have a nice crispy texture, easily perceivable. And our dish is ready. Deep fried zucchini flour with a yogurt dip. <laughs>